Royal Assembly. Huh? Champions Royal Assembly. I mean, where? Johannesburg. Johannesburg. Yes. God wants to anoint you. Come on. Lift her up. Come on. Come on. Lift her up. You have been praying for God to anoint you, eh? Is it true? That's true. And then, even now, you were asking yourself why it's not happening. That's true, man eh? of God. That's true. And even yesterday in the night, you wake up to pray. That's true. Eh? That's true. Yeah. I can tell you you're anointed now. Thank you. They say, brother, what I was telling, come, what I was telling these people, it's happening to you now. Thank you, But Jesus. there's nobody who supports anything. Amen. And you are trying to do things on your own. Amen. But now, God else is anointing you like this. Uh, go raise people to support you now. It's happening now. You come. Let me touch your chest. As I'm touching your chest, let, let me touch your chest. Let me touch your chest. Look here. Look here. There's a spirit that visits you, uh, especially when you are asleep. Uh, this spirit, if it comes to you, everything about you falls down. Uh? Yes, Daddy. Uh? Yes, Daddy. Uh, there was a time we were dreaming, eating things. Yes, yes, uh? yes, twice. And then now you are praying, pray, pray. But this thing, when it comes, it just comes like a, in a season. It doesn't come all the time. But yes. after that, your heart will be down. Your marriage will be like falling. Everything is like going down. Yes. But today, God is restoring your calling. Yeah. Where's your sister? She's at home. Huh? She's at home. Because I'm saying that God wants to bless her. If she must come here. I want to see her. Okay. You understand? Because her faith is affected. Yes. She told you. Yes. That she saw something she has never seen. Yes. And uh, now she's discouraged. Come here. Can you just stand up here? There was a blood that was coming out. Yes. Huh? Blood. There was blood that was coming out. Yes, but it's, sir. It's mingled up with some clothes. Yes. And they were questioning what is happening. Yes, sir. But God loves you because already there's a problem in your womb here. Yes. Huh? I have pains all the pains time. Pains all the time. And I've been here before and, and you prophesied about my womb. I prophesied before. Long time, three, four years ago. Four years ago. Yes. But now four years ago, I don't know you again. Yes. You have changed, and also you have got the red <laughs> lips now. And let me touch you. Let me touch you. Let me touch you here. Touch your womb now. You are free. Amen. And, like, listen to this. Because if I started to move fast, like I was seeing this thing on the same sign I was speaking about. Can you just stand up? Yes. Come here. Let me prophesy you of what God wants to do because there's these people you don't need to trust people do you understand where's your friend the taller one which one the taller one I disconnected myself eh? I disconnected myself completely from all friends can you see let's do like this hold the hand what is it that you remember with this Oh, we are praying. Eh? We are praying with my brothers. We are not three. We are three. The taller one, where is it? It's in Pretoria North. So you were three, eh? Yes. And then there was a taller one. Yes. Come here, let me pray for you. Because you don't need... Let me touch your face. Stand up, listen to this. I just want to advise you, I mean, this thing of doing the work of God, check the people who are working with you. It's not so bad. That brother is, is very good. Are you hearing me? Amen. But, but it seems as if it can change your work like play. Amen. I'm sure you have seen that. Amen. I don't know if you have seen that. I don't know. If you don't know, say, I don't know. I want to explain to you. I'm not aware, Daddy. You see, this one prophesy, another one prophesy, another one prophesy. It's not good for you. Amen. You hear me? Yes, daddy. Eh? Yes, daddy. You do your job now. Yes, daddy. Eh? 
yesterday. Uh, God will lift you. Amen. If you're inviting a person, let the person do the job. Amen. If now you are three, this one do like this, another one do like this, another, you people are like playing. I'm sure you understand what I'm trying to say. Yes, daddy. You know what I'm talking about? Yes, daddy. Eh? Yes, daddy. It happened when? Um, last, last, last weekend. Come, let me anoint you. Because God wants to show you many things. And then, now, if it happens like this, you're a prophet, it will affect many things. Let me just come here. There's a sickness on you. Come. It's affecting these legs. You are free. Let me just come, sir. God is anointing, anointing you. L look here. People, they don't understand you. Yes. Eh? Yes. And they are fighting you. Yes. Because I'm seeing people fighting you. I mean, even talking bad things. Yes. Eh? Yeah. Go to her. No! <laughs> come, brother, come. Where is your mom? Uh, she's in Palawar. Limpopo. We need to pray for her, eh? Yes. So you're aware that I'm she's a, sick? I'm aware. That she's very sick? Yes. Can you just stand up, sir? So, we'll pray for your mom. You, we are praying for your mom now. When we are praying for you. You understand? Yes. Come on. Take. Jesus' name. You are free. Come. Where were you working before? I was working at the college. Huh? As a lecturer. Because I saw the, the struggle. You are yes, facing sir. now. Yes, sir. And I realized that is the issue of you were working somewhere, but now you're no longer working. Your focus is, okay, you're still working here. It yes. Seems you move from here, you come here. Yes, at the moment, I'm with the Department of Water and you Sanitation. You moved out, eh? Yes, to I another moved place. out. Yes. But when you were working, the things were like good in the beginning. Yes. Later, it changes. Then it went down altogether. Everything went down. Yes. But now it's like it's starting now again here where you are. Amen. So it's like you are losing hope of waking now. Altogether. So sometimes you feel like you don't want to go to work. I've attempted three times to yeah? leave my job and go to leave your job. full time into ministry. And then I realized that if you do it very fast, it's going to affect everything. Because in the ministry now, there's no structure. Yes, sir. So, yes, sir. So if now we just carry on the way, it's like this. Is going to give you problems. Can you just carry on working for a while? I hear you, Daddy. Because I see God establishing you. I hear you, Daddy. Otherwise, right now, you don't have anybody who's supporting you. No. And I see you, God, lifting you in front of your enemies. Amen. Amen. Come on. Come on. Take it. Take. Jesus, mighty name. 